Good morning, Acadia. Today is Friday, January 6th, and it is a B day. Can you please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What is for lunch today? Of course, it is pizza on Friday, chickpea salad and steamed spinach. Delicious. Today's birthday, we only have one sixth grader today. And then over the weekend, we've got a couple of birthdays to celebrate. So if you see any of these friends today, wish them a happy birthday. What a great day to celebrate your birthday at a roller skating rink. So guys, Acadia's first couples night is happening tonight at 6.30 to 9.30. I actually took this photo on Monday when I went roller skating. The cost is $5. Five dollars. Do you know what the cost of going without being an Acadia Wolfpack member is? It was twenty-five dollars when I went. The five-dollar admission is awesome. You will have to rent some skates. I believe that's extra. So please, please take advantage of this super, super discount. Uh, you got to purchase tickets at lunch only. Uh, families can attend. Parents can come. It's really, really great. Ticks can be sold uh, during lunch this week. So if you have money, awesome. All right, Acadia Yearbook Club. Next meeting is January 12th and the 26th. It is 8 a.m. in room 207. Coding Club meets every Tuesday from 3.30 to 4.30 in room 919. Students can take the late bus home. Hi guys, so today I'm going to be showing you guys some tips and tricks of beginners on how to skate and uh, just some a couple of questions that I frequently get asked uh, about guptos. So uh, if you don't know, my, gra my family, my grandparents own guptos, so uh, I'm here to help you out with some skating tips and tricks if you are new to skating. So let's get right onto it. So the first thing I want for beginners to know, if it's your first time, anything, is uh, make sure that you bend your back and bend your knees because if you don't, you can end up falling back and that really hurts. Um, it really hurts badly. So make sure that you have uh, your back bent, your knees bent. And um, there are railings at Guptools. If you've never been to Guptools uh, in the roller skating rink, there are railings to help you. They aren't here to, for you to d depend on them, but they are here to, for guidance as you are skating. Um, and uh, another thing I wanted to mention is um, make sure that um, just as you're skating, if it's your first time, make sure that you're not sliding trying to skate. You want to make sure that you're picking up your feet a little bit as you skate. Um, because skating, like just shuffling with your wheels isn't going to help you try to get to like try to get somewhere. Uh, so you want to just uh, pretend, as if you are wearing normal shoes, you're going to want to pick up your feet a little bit to walk. And I call these baby steps. You want to do it little by little by little. Uh, not going as like far away for steps. You want to do it little, little, and little. So you go like this and you have this for guidance. Um, so that, those are some beginner tips and tricks. But another thing I want to mention is clothing. So for clothing, um, it gets very hot at Cuptos if you've never been. Even in the winter, it can get very hot. So underneath your coats and stuff, because it is winter, um, I want, so make sure that you wear something short sleeves, something breathable to wear. Uh, don't wear something long sleeve because you will, you are working out and it can get very hot. And um, because jeans don't rip as easily and it will and somehow it prevents like not getting hurt as much um, so that is another thing I wanted to mention make sure you wearing something breathable something and if you are to wear leggings uh, be sure that you're wearing them with caution make sure you don't wear all your nice ones um, just try to find something that you know if it's okay it's okay if it gets ripped if it's okay if something happens to it because that can happen sometimes um, but yeah, that's kind of it for clothing. Um, but another thing I wanted to do is a little bit of a Q&A. So some questions I get asked frequently. So uh, one of them I get asked all the time is what kind of food do they have there? Um, so we, well, we have 
fries, we have fried dough, uh, we have pretzels, pizza, we have all of that stuff, and there is a menu on the top of the snack bar, so you can see whatever you want to get. And for drinks, we have ugh, sodas, we have water, we have slushies, a whole bunch of different flavors, I think about six flavors. Uh, my personal favorite is either lemon, lime, or grape. Um, strawberry comes in for a close third, but yes, yeah, so that's one of them. Another one I wanted to say is, well, uh, where do you put your stuff? Well, there is lockers that you can get for 25 cents, uh, and if not, you can tuck it under your, your belongings underneath one of the benches, like one of the chairs. Uh, but if you are afraid of your stuff, like just being out in the open, I uh, definitely recommend the locker. It's only a quarter um, per locker. So there's that. And then another one I get asked is for if you aren't going on a school night, uh, how much is it for skating? So if you don't have own your own roller, roller skates, it is uh, $5 for rental. And uh, unfortunately, we do not rent out rollerblades, but we do rent out roller skates. If you, but you are free, feel free to bring your own rollerblades, roller skates, and all of that stuff. So that's all I wanted to say. Um, yeah, so thanks for listening, and hopefully you have fun tonight at Guptos. Bye. Mm -hmm.